there's no videos to watch, so we're gonna watch our own animation video. And then we're gonna react to this video. And then we're gonna react to this video again. Can we react to us reacting to this video? Exactly. And then reacting to us reacting to this video, reacting to this video, reacting to this video. Help, help, get me out of this cycle. There's no leaving. Let me out! Today, we're going to be telling our most painful stories, and at the end, I will tell you how I ended up in the hospital. But first, let's start with Nadway. Uh, the animation so style like changed so much. I, it's so I clean. I wanted to send Juice a funny video. I put my phone against the wall, but like on the floor. I re this is real, right? Yeah, yeah. it's 100% yeah, real, it's, it's dude. I wish, real, I yeah. I wish I had the video. I wish I had it. recorded a video of me <laughs> screaming something, and then I jumped head first <laughs> into the wall. Into the wall? <laughs> the wall? I was, trying to, I was trying to jump into the phone, but then I miscalculated and jumped a little bit too high. So I went head first into the wall and made a hole in my wall. You got a big old oh head. I was home alone it's at fixed, the time. Man. I it's didn't fixed. know what to it's, tell my parents. It's fixed. I told they, they, they sealed it up. I was working out and I was running around and I tripped on a wire and I fell into the hole. Wait, wait, just, wait, wait. Do they know it now? Like the real story? No. I literally dolphin dived into the wall. I'm not even joking. The video was like I had on my phone, but I was too scared of my parents finding the evidence so i just deleted it because wow. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. i might be in juice's dms and I'm... yeah maybe well, way gets his phone let's hear another story was that actually your most painful moment and i haven't really been hurt that much i can fix that <laughs> Mr. Mimi. Oh, I, I'm just a Chad. I, I, you know, I've broken many bones. Yeah, many no. This guy is <laughs> not real, bro. I refuse to believe he's <laughs> real. Okay, so. Shut up, Mimi. Here's the hole in the wall. There it is. I still can't get over how small the hole is. Yeah, why is it's the wall not so that small? small? You made it smaller. No, no, you made it smaller than <laughs> animation. No, it's just. Well, what do you. This is the picture you sent. No, go back. That's the real size. You made it smaller. I'm perfect. Oh, there you that, go. That's yeah. the real size. What do you mean? That's the real size that's the same size no yeah, it's the same size not. That's the same it's size. This is bigger. Nah. You can see that Photoshop. Let a real man tell the story, okay? When I was three years old, I was a dumb baby like Ned. Oh, okay? I know for sure you were. I also had like deep social anxiety or something, so. At three? Is this where he yeah, was dropped on his head? Like I think he was dropped multiple like times on his head. Seconds. Or like had like a gulab jamun or something. I would start oh, crying. What? <laughs> One day, my mom left me on the bed to go downstairs real quick. She had to make like some gulab jamun or something. She went into my right? bed. Dude, the fact they made that a trip is so funny, dude. Do you have that have beef with me? Did they have beef with me? They're just showing reality, man. Yeah, they couldn't draw the Lightning McQueen bed because it's copyrighted. No, you're not even a real beef. Like, you don't even exist. Okay, so literally, like, three minutes of unsupervision and my blood pressure was rising as a baby, okay? The bed was, like, 10 foot high or something, so I couldn't even get down. Somehow, as, like, a three-year-old baby, I managed to do some parkour. Parkour? Yeah, I was doing, like, a handstand jump off the bed to a cat. Cabinet. I slid down the handles of the desk and then I jumped on the floor that was a and started eating. That that's, that's a sick scene. Explains a lot. Yeah, I totally didn't just fall on my head. Once I got on the floor, I started crawling towards the stairs because my mom was downstairs. You know, this was in India, so like the stairs were weren't made out of wood. They were made out of like hard stone, like marble Ooh. or something. Yeah, bro. Oh something God. happened to him internally. I could hear my mom downstairs, way. and more importantly, I could smell the galab jam. So yeah, I started crawling. One. Step, two step, I'm getting closer. Three step, four step. Falls down the stairs. No, not yet. I crawled <laughs> down the first two stairs. Things. I successfully did it. Five step, I don't know what comes after five, but my hand slipped. I rolled over and everything slowed down. Okay. How do you I, do this? Only meme guy can have something like this happen <laughs> to him. Like. And just as time slowly snapped back to reality, I landed directly on my left eye. Ah. Oh, no. oh. How'd you no. do that? I, I just told you how I did it. I oh, felt yeah. that. That's true. <laughs> I swear Juicy's not a real person. Yeah, what do you mean? Dude, Juicy, you I do not, that? It's not just this animation. Every animation, you're like the same person. Like, this is such a Juicy moment. This line right here where you say this. <laughs> oh, my oh. God. Oh, God. How'd you no. do that? <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you say that? In the most monotone know. voice Bo ever. Because you, 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 you just said the entire story and you say.
How'd you do that? My brain only processes the past two seconds of the history. AI so you zones out. <laughs> <laughs> That's me. I just I just zone out and I yeah. What do you tell the ladies when they ask what the scar is about? I saved a baby in the fire or something. They get you every time. They get you every time. And me, bro. I haven't said nothing. I haven't say anything. What did I do? They just know. <laughs> Or it's just, this is going out. I don't know how I didn't die. I, I should have like just rolled down from here because like the stairs were like very, very long and like it's further destroyed effects. my head, but I survived. So I just had to get like stitches in That's my crazy. left eye. So you can still see them to this Whoa. day if you look close enough. And I yeah, I was the baby that was eyes? You, you, yeah, you, dropped on your head. you dropped yourself on your head, bro. Also, I don't know if this story is true because I, I literally spawned in the world at the age of 11. I have no consciousness before that. But Is anyone the same? I feel like I had no my own self awareness that until like 18. Until 18? Yeah. Exactly. You've been alive for like four years? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I feel like everything from 18 under just does not matter. He was incubating like a leg. Mom told me this. He just gave me a vivid story about it. <laughs> My mom told, told me this. I'm gonna go eat some glock jam. Blasa told me after when he saw this, dude, he, he said that that wasn't even supposed to be in the animation. He just said that r randomly. Yeah, why is it there? Why is the point of that? You said it. <laughs> and I, I don't know why you said it. Saying. I don't know why I never said that. TBH, it's time to tell your story. I think my story is the most related. This is the most painful story. I was like five or six. <laughs> oh, my brother was the kind of person that would sit me down and watch me do my homework. Because I never did my homework. Either someone watched me do it or I didn't do it at all. My brother once squeezed the bathroom. And I was like, hmm, my nails are a little long. So oh. how can I cut them without getting out of my seat? Teeth. No, I see that's that's the logical answer. That's the logical <laughs> answer, right? But I wanted the perfect edges. So I was trying to figure out how I could get the perfect, beautiful edges on my nails. So I'm looking through my bag because I don't want to bite that? my nails. Because biting my nails, that's gross. So I found the next best thing. A pencil sharpener. A pencil Wait, sharpener. No. Pencil sharpener. Oh my God. Did you go to your local school? No, I was just in my bag. You know, I was like, do they still have pencil sharpeners in school in that way? Yeah. But they got like the one like attached to the wall. That feels so long ago. But how would that make it clean? Allie, I'm six. <laughs> <laughs> my six year old brain is like, okay, if I just put my finger, my pinky finger, my little ooh, 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 pinky finger, in the I, pencil this. Finger, I love that sound effect. Twist. The nail's gonna get a perfect cut. I gave it a little twist, and then half of my nail was gone. A perfect oh my God. Oh. Two thirds of my nail is actually gone, okay? I had a third of it, and I didn't even cry. And you know why I didn't cry? I, I looked at my like an 80 year old grandpa. And I thought about every <laughs> life choice I did oh, before this dessert. moment that led up to this. And I just looked at my fingernail and I was like, huh? huh? That wasn't the best idea. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> After like two minutes of processing, I tried to get my fingernail out of it, you know, because it wasn't fully gone yet. It was like... Um, oh. Yeah, it was really bad. My finger was like surgically attached to the the pencil sharpener at this point, right? So then I tried to get it out, and that Wait, it was that's still in. It was uh, still in. Ah! It was, oh! that, that was right? so my finger was stuck inside the pencil sharpener, and if I tried to move it even an inch, not even an inch, a centimeter. Losing his mind. I was in the, the moment. Safety and comfort oh this house. Why are they all leaving me? <laughs> Why are we just leaving Ali? What was that? <laughs> the most excruciating pain would come out of it, okay? So now I'm stuck and I have to go to my mom. He's like, Mommy, I, I got Aww. my finger stuck in a pencil Aww. sharpener. You little TBH. <laughs> How dumb are you for putting your finger in a pencil sharpener? And my only response was, I thought it would work. That's it. That's, <laughs> that's my only thought, bro. I thought it would work. Did it work? Two thirds of my nail is gone. Okay? So it worked. But it was a clean cut. <laughs> It was that a clean cut. It got a little bit more than the nail. That's all I'm saying. How'd you get it out? Oh, we just ripped it out. Oh, oh my God. Oh. <laughs> this explains why he has claws. Let's hear a story from Allie. I like when they draw the, like, dad and mom versions of us. It's very funny to me. <laughs> just like a mustache or like... What? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, who said that? 
Natalie. <laughs> it's oh. not me. She, she's just been waiting to. I love that. I love this shot so much. I want this to be a plushie <laughs> so bad. <laughs> it's Natalie, such a good shot. Him. <laughs> Talk about his like pain. <laughs> I think Juicy is the only other person here that broke a bone. I never broke a bone, but one time when I was a kid, I was in the bathroom and I was playing with my uh, Hello Kitty like toothbrush holder, and it was like pink, and I had like a little Hello Kitty on it. A wink. Like filling it up with water, and then I decided to tape it. Spell? So, dude, I know every frame by frame. Oh I know all of this. Just open, and then I kept filling it with like more water through like a little tiny hole on the top. After a while, I just got bored, so I just decided to like cut the tape off and empty the water out. And so I grabbed a pair of scissors and started to cut the tape. But I was standing at the sink, and I. Dude, the animators telling me that they're putting 80% of the budget into these next two scenes. I was like, <laughs> yeah. do it. I got distracted when I looked at myself. <laughs> <laughs> what a frame. No, what the no. hell? Got shading and shadow on everything. It is amazing. And then all of a sudden, no the AI use. Like, you know what I just realized? Just Imagine the animating and then with all of this. Also That's really good. dope. You like something bad happened. Like I felt it. Like I was like I oh. froze. I love how it goes from like literally 4K <laughs> into <laughs> literally like four dollar doodles. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't. They didn't even decide to animate legs this time. Slowly so looked down and there was a big gash across oh. my finger. It looked like my finger was like almost cut off. That means my story is relatable. So I started running around the bathroom screaming and crying. You know how much water you wasted? True. You know how many people True. could drink that water? Water around I was crying and screaming until my mom came in. She's like, what happened? And I shoved it in her face to show her. I'm dying. <laughs> Look at this mom. So I shoved her in her face. <laughs> she told me we have to go to the hospital. And I was like, no. I was like scared. I was like, no, I don't want to go to the hospital. Maybe it'll stop bleeding. It and won't. they put you down. <laughs> she looked off. at me and my mangled finger and was like, bruh. bruh. And she just like <laughs> threw me into the car. <laughs> she took me to the hospital. Hospital, and they stitched it up and Yippee. I have like four or five stitches in my finger and you then have I got ice cream. Oh, wow, I do. Wow, wow, I have wow, like that wow, extra wow, line wow, of my wow, finger. So Wait, are you like double jointed right now? Like, could you like move your finger like three ways now? It didn't what? break. It just, I had a giant slit to like, oh, you do can you have see, a like, scar? Like Ooh, a permanent yeah. scar? Uh, yeah. My meat. Uh, Whoa. Like brains. It was like brains. Oh, brains. Uh, you can see the muscle. Yeah. So anyway, let me tell a real man story. Wow, real man <laughs> story, Juicy. It's high quality. So basically, I woke up on an average British day. They did you. They did you so well. Dude, they did you. Know, you. Honestly, insane. the next thirty seconds are probably my favorite. Dude, look how clean my teeth are. It's Oh, Dude, they did that. Exactly. Oh, what? Me, how are they doing? That is wrong. Right. That's not lore accurate. <laughs> what you? Oh, oh sure you wow. Okay. wow. That is untrue. We're only telling true stories here, Juicy. This was before <laughs> the head injury. It is a true story, okay? So I woke up. I was like, so. I love this. Okay. Thank you for that one, Juicy. I love it. Look how cute he is. Cute. Oh, my God. Seven years old, I was getting ready to go to school. You know, average day. Average, average day. Average day British. It came to lunch. They put in Hogwarts, we dude. It's crazy. <laughs> this game oh, works. Oh, 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 you know, you jump oh, two legs. What? This is not funny, okay? This is not a laughing matter. Okay, anyway. So there's this game called Hopscotch, okay? Hopscotch! <laughs> <laughs> me and me, I was actually master it, by the way. I accidentally tripped over my own leg. I had an amazing British man. And then I literally started falling in slow motion. And I tried to save myself. But then I, I my elbow was pointing towards Ooh. the floor. Like towards the concrete, and I was trying to save myself, and I landed directly on top of my right elbow. Ooh. I was literally. Oh. Boom, I hit the floor and I was like, I didn't know what happened because I had a lot of adrenaline at first. So I got up, I looked around, everybody was standing there just. How, how painful actually was that from like one to 10? When I'd done it, I didn't feel anything. But then after like five minutes, it then started to really hurt. I was like, yeah, damn, I did something really yeah. bad. Like, I couldn't even like move my elbow properly. I had to like hold my elbow oh. in my arm. Oh. Like it was like, yeah, like broken. Oh. It was awful. Yeah. And the teacher was looking at me. 
at me and she came running over and I was like, I was about to burst out crying. Goofy and then the teacher comes in and grabs me obviously. and starts drinking your tears. No! <laughs> and then pulls me away. So I was literally carrying my elbow. The school oh. called, right? The ambulance. Wow. And, then, wow. and then my mum turned up as well. And then basically they your took... <laughs> <laughs> is this true? Is your is your mom an alcoholic? Do you see? That's the way to. Your mom turned up. Drinking and driving. That's the correct way to drive. Basically, I refused to go in the ambulance what? because I was scared of ambulances. I don't know why. Dude, I was scared. I was scared. Are you still scared of ambulances? No. Basically, my mom had to take me in her car. Did look at my mom go. Followed the ambulance to the hospital. Following the ambulance. Yeah. You know how funny that costume is. <laughs> Oh, did you still have to pay for the charge of the ambulance? No. Oh, <laughs> no. Free healthcare. So Isn't it free? free healthcare. Yeah. Oh, free healthcare. Oh, wow. That's okay. crazy. Let Blaza tell it. Damn. Damn, Blaza, Damn. you kicked up. I like that. <laughs> well, 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 well. I'm tired of hearing oh, all these baby okay, stories. Okay, okay. Calm <laughs> down, Blaza. Toddler stories. Yeah, I'm the only one that's not a baby. Oh, wait, wait, I just realized that's an insult, bro. I just realized that's a f insult. <laughs> I just realized. Oh, wait, then you're normal. <laughs> I just realized that's an insult. These what? babies with the little toddler stories. Wait, wait, I wait. actually. Shut up. I actually <laughs> broke bones. My first time I broke my arm, I was in school like i was oh wait never mind no there was another time i broke a lot of bones you said you didn't break your head as well the most recently a year ago i remember this so i was this going to america for the first time I'm, 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 I'm gonna meet my friends i was gonna meet sucks for one that was real it was like a week before my flight and i had my last dirt biking race i was a little nervous i was like okay this is my last race look I at this budget this. Dude, they, yeah. they made you I handsome handsome blood Plaza. Oh my they god. They my face for this and then they uh, <laughs> priced it over. I was at the starting gate. So there's like a long gate with like 40 people in a row. And I was revving my engines. I was like, so and it was a sign. Oh, it just oh, so quick. seconds to the great talk. I did, took a deep breath <laughs> and I stared at the gate in front of me <laughs> and the gate <laughs> dropped. Go. And I. <laughs> oh my god. He's going. Oh my god. He's going. 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 He's Oh my god, I'm the first one. I'm gonna win this. So I slammed in the brakes. I put my foot out. I'm ready to make the left corner. That's the right corner. And I look to my left and wham! Some kind of idiot doesn't know how to brake and slams right into me. That was me, my bad. So I get up. I get up, I'm like, damn. I look, I look. <laughs> 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 That's beautiful. Is that you? I feel like I've seen that before. I don't know no. where. Dub his bike and he left. I'm sorry, like, I'm okay. nervous. I can't make eye contact. <laughs> so I'm like, whatever. I'll catch up. I stand up. I pick up my bike. And I cannot pick up my bike. Uh, what's going on here? I look at my left arm. And it was shaped like the cool ass you draw in school. <laughs> oh, what? That's like, actually Ooh. talent. First I was like walking in circles. I didn't, I didn't know what to do. My, my arm is an ass. What do I do? I can't live like this. No. So I sat down and the medic came. And we're like, damn. This sucks. And, then, <laughs> damn. Oh, and I didn't feel much because I had adrenaline and stuff because because I because of the start. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I sat down and I sat there for like five minutes and all of a sudden I got like dizzy and stuff. I was like, oh dude, that's not good. The doctor said, oh it's all good. You're just a little. Oh, good, I, think you scared. I think you should get a new doctor, bro. There's no way. Yeah. All good. <laughs> yeah, sure, all good. The doctor. She said, sit down, drink this. Uh, Pill. Pill? <laughs> 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 it's like, it like a med kit pill. It's a med kit, okay? Med kit pill, okay. Dude didn't have any water, so I had to, to swallow that stuff dry. And I started feeling better after yeah, that. Feels, and oh. then I was like, oh my god, I have a flight next week. And then I couldn't fly because. Why couldn't you still go? Why yeah, that's a great question. How, how come you can't fly with a broken arm? Look at my arm. So what? What do you, what do you climb well, can, up Can you not fly? Does it, does it require you? Doctor appointments and stuff. What about the race? The ra I couldn't continue the race. My arm Bruh. was shaped like an S. Now, we've got just a barrier at the most right of time. So broke a bone. <laughs> no, actually, back real. in the day when I used to go outside, I used to skateboard a lot, okay? Not that cringe skateboard with four wheels. Uh-uh, none of that. I'm talking about the rip stick. Anyone else rip stick? Part yeah, of I did not know how to skateboard, so if I tried to rip stick, I would fall in. Rip stick is easier than It's easier. It's easier than skateboarding. Yeah, it's much easier. Well, I was sucked at both, so. 
doesn't really matter. Oh. <laughs> Altered viewers. The ripstick is like the coolest trend back in the day. It was a skateboard that only had two wheels. One mm -hmm. in the front, one in the back. Crazy, right? You must be asking, how the heck do you balance on two wheels? The trick was, as soon as you got onto the skateboard, you, take notes, you have to do this like little right dance. You gotta little. do the, the shot. <laughs> Well, that's how you do it. You exactly. have to do a little shava shava to get the board moving. And if yeah, you stop yeah, dancing, yeah. you had no momentum and boom, you would just fall flat on your face. Now that we're all educated, how does this have anything to do with breaking a bone? Well, me and the neighborhood gang. True. Okay, we <laughs> the gang. Look at the You know, doing normal kid stuff. Scaring pedestrians, robbing houses, breaking down lemonade stands. Yeah, there we were, were just menaces. These, like, we were feeling adventurous. We never went past medium difficulties. So, you know, we felt like we were going to do the nightmare path just to put it in perspective there's like three more stages of difficulty until the nightmare path there was hard extreme extreme plus then nightmare so Who that ranked means these? the hoa came together they were like let's let's make all these different hills as a oh. child how do you know about the hoa we ran the hoa obviously as part of the ripstick gang the turns were like sharper than like a, an ice cream cone okay you know the bottom of an ice cream cone like pew, pew. we arrived to the path <laughs> 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 And the reason was I was really stupid. Right? It wasn't because I was brave. I was just I can... dumb. Without hesitation, I got on my ripstick and I started going down the path. Whee! I picked up really quickly. Drop off. This is crazy. Okay, we were, it was like we were motorbiking. All right, it was at the same speed. And I didn't even have to do the shava shava because all you had to do was like stay balanced because you already had enough momentum. Like I didn't need more speed. So all seemed going well for like the first couple seconds until we arrived at the first turn. The problem with the ripstick is yeah, you see how long this is this this literally all happened in maybe like three seconds no real way to slow down other than like jumping off don't tell me you jumped off no we didn't we didn't jump off you know with a normal skateboard you can at least put down like one foot to like slow you down a bit but uh-huh not with this you gotta like keep two two of your feet on the ground now we're going to the sharpest turn i ever encountered but like in my head i thought i could do it like easily i thought i could go and easy right in the head <laughs> visualize it it's easy but in reality as i was turning the the speed was so great, I flew from like the, the whole ripstick just like flew from. I'm so glad I have like a like a. And they shot I, I got a nice and butt, you know. In the air, I was like, I feel like if I was bony, I, I wouldn't be alive. What I did we is like my legs were up in the air. I put my hands right yeah, beneath me, it. like to protect my butt. Yeah. Oh no, that's not how that works. That doesn't sound safe at all. And I, I kept my hands there underneath me to protect me. So the impact of me hitting the ground oh, was this like is the straight worst thing you could have done. No, yeah, your butt could have easily catched that. I mean, the good news is that I'm on the ground, right? I mean. The bad news is that you I felt like exist. this extreme sharp pain, like immediately right into my right wrist. But the thing was, like when I got up, unless I moved it, it didn't hurt. I know that I actually went swimming that very day with the broken wrist. Swimming hurts so much if you have a broken wrist. I've had broken wrist before, and it's like healed, and you swim, and it still hurts. So how do you even come up with that? It wasn't a great swimming session. <laughs> but like, if I just leave my arm alone, it'll just heal itself. I, I, I kind of just got up and. And I didn't think it was broken because I was just like, shouldn't I be in constant pain right now if it was broken? But no, it didn't hurt if I didn't move it. I'm surprised you weren't. Adrenaline blaster, it doesn't mean things to your body. Like it was like, if I didn't move it, I didn't feel it. But that's not the problem, all right? The problem was what? I went back home that day, still not knowing my, still my right ripstick, by the way. So I go, I, I go to bed. <laughs> I'm going to freak this off. I'm going to feel better. Bed? Maybe uh -huh. I it was My ripsticks were on my feet right now. I the next morning. I need to take a piss. I go to open the door. I completely I completely forgot what happened the day before. So I this go the to open pain. the door with Don't my tell. right hand and I do that oh, little twist. No. It's those oh. That was like a 10. It was the worst pain ever. I, I was literally holding back here. Okay, actually, one thing that I would now actually say that's more painful than this is finger tattoos. Really? Yeah. More painful than the, a broken than jumping bone. on your hands. Yes. Like, Get finger. Your tailbone tattooed. A tailbone tattoo? Ooh. Oh. Ooh, that okay. Would be a challenge. Okay. So I changed my hands to the left hand so I could open the door. I have this habit that I always need a locked door. So mm -hmm. locked doors. So I have that to habit. Press, like this little button on the door handle, right? It's like this little button, like, boop, boop, you know? Forgetting again. Like, I'm pretty sure I have dementia. Like, and forgetting my right hand was in pain. I went up to go lock it, and I pressed the button.
person with my right thumb. Oh, I still You're remember that. You're not so bright, are you? It wasn't even my right wrist. Turns out my right thumb was also How broken. old were you? <laughs> this was like last week. And I had like this immediate shell shock because I pressed the button and my right wrist is broken. So you hear this look and then oh. it also sends the response. The animation. Your, right wrist that is broken. your phone is not supposed to make that sound. My whole body like vibrated. It's like you shocked it by electricity. This isn't good. Yeah. It does actually feel like like when you have like such a sudden joint of pain, it's like electricity running through your body. Honestly, at the end of the day, you know what was worse? When they put the cast on, you came and shot. Oh, I can't get over the smell. Like, it, doesn't it, smell? it smells yeah. so yeah, bad. It's terrible. The cast wet, and because of that, like the smell so gets like bad. really bad. We just reacted to our own animation. If you guys enjoyed that and you want us to rag more, subscribe. You reacted to yourself, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's peak.